Let's look at this picture. How much money would Luce have if she had three pennies and seven nickels? We could add the amount that each coin is worth and find out she has 38 cents, or we could use multiplication. That shortcut for adding the same thing again and again. Three plus five times seven, 38 cents. This presents a bit of a problem in writing down what we did though. If I didn't have the nickels and the pennies, can you see how we might get a different answer? If we did the addition first, I use this arrow to show the steps, we'd think we had 56 cents instead of 38. Not a good thing. So mathematicians have agreed that the more powerful multiplication or division should be done before any addition or subtraction. You'll need a sharp eye. Sometimes it looks like you should add first. Don't be fooled. Learn the language. It's not what it looks like, it's what it means. Now, if you see parentheses wrapped around an action, like I did here, that does mean do that first. Parentheses and some other grouping symbols that we'll talk about later mean do this part first. But it makes more sense to do multiplication and division before addition and subtraction. Here's another example. Four touchdowns, three extra points, and one field goal at a football game. Different points for each thing. We could add them all up separately, or we could use multiplication. Mathematicians like shortcuts. The total score is four touchdowns, which are six points each, three extra points, one point each, one field goal worth three points. These all had to be converted into points before adding them together. When you're adding, you have to be adding the same thing to each other. Points plus points plus points. So our shortcut here is deciding we don't need parentheses. We will do the multiplication before adding or subtracting. So it's going to be 24 plus three, plus three, and then we can put that together. And our final score is 30. The thing to remember, do multiplication and division, they're more powerful, before addition and subtraction. Keep learning, you can do this.